Are you in there? Open up! You're in serious danger! What gives, man? You can't just bust in here like this. I already told you, we know TD is in your room. The TD is evil and will eventually kill you. I don't think he's bad, I think he's just misunderstood. If you won't let me have a friend, I'll jump. I mean it, I'll jump. <gasps> that train, I think we can make it. So are you guys on the run? Something like that. Kinda running away from the man. Told you this train stops here. Come on, open up! We know you're in there! They've been following us all night, like, this is the end, man. There's no one on this side. You could sneak out this way, I'll try to stall. Hey, there they are, over there! They found you! Run! Oh man, this is last night all over again. They're gaining on us. You think I don't know that? Only a miracle will save us now. Hey there, need a ride? It's okay, I'm nice. Trust me, I can save you! Oh well, what do we gotta lose? We couldn't be in any more trouble anyway. Oh wow, thanks for saving our butts back there. I thought we were goners for sure. No problem. You're lucky I came down here and saw you. Oh wow. You poor little thing. You're hurt. What? This? It's nothing. I almost forgot about it. I can fix you. Hold still. Hey, that's like in a movie I saw that I can't say the name of for copyright reasons. Oh wow. Are you an angel? <laughs> Not really. My name's Moonbeam, and I'm a star kid. I kinda look after the galaxy and stuff. Wow, you live in space? That's gotta be awesome. Yeah, it's okay, I guess. You'll have to excuse him. He's absolutely obsessed with space. Hey, you guys hear that? Oh man, I think someone's in trouble. Come on guys, this isn't funny anymore. Let me go! What's that you say? You want us to keep doing this? Very well then. No wait, um, okay, this is funny. Keep bullying me. Oh, now you want to be bullied? Very well then, punch bad. Stop! Because you do opposite of what I say. Just stop it already. No way! It's time for your punishment! Why? I've done nothing wrong. Yes, you have, Fox Boy. You're weird. And you're nice. We don't take kindly to weird around here. Yeah. And we especially don't take kindly to nice. What's that behind you? Oh no, we're not falling for that. We may be dumb, but we're not that dumb. Yeah, we're not that dumb. Hey, leave him alone. Uh-oh, company. Let's get out of here. Yeah, you'd better run. Hey kid, you okay? Yeah, I think so. I'll get you down. I almost got it. Oof. Oh, sorry about that. Are you hurt? I'm okay. They didn't hurt me this time. Wait, this isn't the first time they've bullied you? No, I get bullied almost every day. I'm kind of getting used to it anyway. Dude, that's not cool. 
You don't need to take that. You should go home and tell your parents about this. But... I'll even come with you and make sure you get home safe. But... It's okay, man. There's no shame in telling your folks that you're being bullied and you're too small and weak to defend yourself. But I don't have any parents! Oh, I'm sorry. I should have just kept my big mouth shut. Well, you didn't know. Yeah, but... Oh man, I feel terrible now. So, um, like, where do you live anyway? Uh, out here. Out here? Oh man, I've done it again. I'm sorry, I didn't know you had no home. It's not too bad. And the other creatures in the forest are my friends. Except when they scram when I'm in trouble. So you've always lived out here? Yeah, I think so. My memory's kind of fuzzy. Well, you are kind of fuzzy. Kind of adorable, actually. <laughs> no. I mean, I can't remember too good. I remember I woke up in this forest one day. But I can't remember anything before that. I don't know where it came from or nothing. Hey, no way. That's exactly what happened to me. Talk about a coincidence. I know, right? You know what? I'll be your friend if you want. And I won't desert you when you need help. What do you say? Wanna be friends? Uh. Whoa, easy there. You could have just said yes. You know something? You kind of remind me of someone, like I know you from somewhere. You look so familiar, but I just can't put my finger on it. At least you got a real friend now, and I'm sure my other two friends will like you. Your other two friends? Yeah, they're pretty cool. Well, actually they're kind of weird, but they're really nice. Hey, um, I hate to break up the party, but you'll need it. What's up? I need to go! Oh. Okay, we won't look. No, I don't mean that. We've got to get out of here. The wormhole between here and my space station is about to close, and if we don't go right now, we'll be, like, stranded here. Oh, uh, guess we better go then. Can I bring my new friend with us? Well, I don't know. Come on, he's all out here on his own with nowhere to go. Can we keep him, please? Okay, but hurry up, we're almost out of time. Sorry we gotta buzz off like this, but, you know, the wormhole? I just hope we can make it out of here before it's too late. Um, is that it? Oh no, it's worse than I thought. I don't think we're gonna make it. We'll make it. We ain't gonna. We're gonna. Ain't. We are. Ain't. Told you we ain't gonna make it. So wait, like, we're stranded here? This is all my fault! Huh? What makes you think this is your fault, man? Well, if you didn't find me, you could have gotten back before that portal thingy closed. And now, I got you all stranded here. Well, we're not totally stranded here. We can still get back. It's just gonna take longer, because we don't have the shortcut anymore. Could have told us that before. So, where are we going? To our space station, dummy. You mean, in space? Well, duh. <laughs> duh, you're funny. I like you. So we're, like, going to space? Like, right now? Uh-huh. Oh, wow! Dude, you're, like, shaking the whole thing. Oh, sorry, but I've never been to space before. Uh, are you guys aliens? Um, I don't think so. Well, I am, but I'm a nice alien. Sure is getting dark. I thought it was still morning. It is, but we're leaving the planet's atmosphere. We're almost at the edge of space. If you look down, you can see how high we are. Oh. 
Pretty cool, huh? Come on, move out of the way. Freaking space hogs. What's up with you two? We're in space! There's no air out here! Oh, no need to worry about that. This cloud has an atmosphere generator, so there's lots of breathable air. You wouldn't even be able to hear me if there wasn't any. <sighs> Won't be long now. Whoa, what's that hunk of junk? My brother's space station. Oh, wow, sorry. But he really keeps it that way? Well, no. He just went missing one day. We never did find him, you know? You remind me a lot of him. That place gives me the creeps. Hey, look, there's another one. That one's mine. Well, this is my pad. What do you think? Groovy. Awesome! Meh. Hadn't we ought to introduce ourselves anyway? I'm TD. Well, I'm Red. Yes, I can see that you are Red. No, I didn't mean I'm Red. Well, I guess I am Red. But I mean, I'm Red. I know, I can still see that. No, I mean, I'm Red. This could go on for some time, so we're just gonna skip to the next part. And I'm, um, Moonfish. What did you say your name was? Moonfish? No way! That's my brother's name! Wow, small universe. No way! I, 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 I can't believe it! What, this? I've had this birthmark forever. That's why I wear this headband, so people don't see it and make fun of it. No, you totally don't understand. Look! That was cool! Oh wow. Do you know what this means? We have built-in flashlights? No, silly. This means that you're my long-lost brother. You're a star kid too! Oh wow. This is too much. First I find out I'm not human. And then I find out you're my own sister? I was even thinking about asking you out. <laughs> hey man, it's not funny. But I don't even look like you. Yeah, I'm kind of puzzled by that myself. But I'm sure you're him. Wait, I'm not trying to hug you. I'm just trying to restore your original form. If you really are my brother, I can get it back. Aw, oh, man. I was enjoying that. Whoa! It really is you! Too much, man. Too much. Well, I think it's about time to show him the way of the Star Kids. <laughs>